This is Muriel and as you can see she has quite deep wrinkling and lining on her skin and this would be quite a challenge for any wrinkle treatment or skin treatment you'd, try, uh, you'd care to apply to this but what we're going to do is put a raise instant facelift uh, on actually only half of her face so at the end of this in a few minutes you'll be able to see the, the distinct difference between the two sides. Um, as you can see it's being applied uh, very close around her eye area and that's a perfectly safe thing to do. Uh, the product is quite safe for anywhere on your skin. In fact, you can uh, very successfully use it on your neck, although we're not going to try and apply it in this case. It's very important before you start to clean your skin uh, thoroughly, preferably with a cleanser, uh, to get rid of any oil residues that may be there, uh, because oil uh, reduces the effectiveness of the product. It's also important to apply it very sparingly. You really only need a very small amount. Apply it thinly. There's no need to rub it in. Uh, just apply it over uh, any area that you would like to improve and uh, sit back for about three minutes and watch it take effect. Now you can see there from her hair moving a little bit that we've just turned a fan on. It does help uh, a little bit to blow cold air over the area. This is not essential, um, but if you do so, it will dry more quickly and give you a slightly better effect. The easiest way to do this is with a hairdryer. But as I said, it's, it's not essential that you do this, only if it's convenient to do so. So that's now fully applied, and all we need to do is uh, sit back and uh, watch the effect. Now when we make these videos, we purposely use fairly harsh lighting to, uh, to highlight any problems that the skin might have. And uh, we don't change the lighting at all during the three minutes or so it takes to do this. Uh, we don't edit the video in any way. This is completely authentic and uh, happening in real time just as you see it. And already you'll see a, quite a substantial effect um, on, on her cheek there. And have a look at her uh, forehead. You'll see on the side that isn't treated, it's quite deeply uh, creased, but uh, on the treated side, her right and our left, uh, it's almost completely wrinkle-free. So there you have the clear side, and in a moment I'm sure Muriel will turn and uh, show us the untreated side, and you, you'll find that there's quite a contrast between the two. Now, this is a result you simply can't get with products like Botox. Uh, Botox injections uh, are designed to paralyze the muscles, and, and the, the reason to do that is that the muscles will then not tug on the skin and cause these wrinkles. Uh, the problem is it immobilizes your face or those areas that you've treated. Um, instant facelift uh, actually tightens your skin. Uh, it doesn't restrict movement in any way. The tightening simply makes the, the wrinkles disappear. And you have a natural look uh, that is you, uh, some, uh, the way you looked some years ago. Uh, if you look at uh, Muriel's face at the moment, you'll see that the, the so-called nasolabial fold, which is that line that runs uh, from her nose down to the side of her mouth and below, that's still quite pronounced. And one of the nice things you can do with instant facelift, if you find an area that uh, you haven't treated properly, you can just go over it uh, and fix it. We're not going to do it in this case, uh, but uh, we, we could reduce that further. Uh, and there you have the untreated side. You can see the forehead clearly there. And the treated side. And that will last for Muriel at, uh, at least eight hours. Uh, probably quite a bit more. 
and she can reapply at any time she feels she needs to.